Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be going through the Mother's Day range that they have at Lush. I haven't got every single thing with me but I have got most of it and as usual I won't be going through gifts. Uh, I've got a lovely array of things to show you so let's get stuff. First of all some good news about Over and Over. So this was originally launched for Valentine's Day. We had some even more good news and that's that it's staying on forever. So this one you'll be able to get in all your Lush stores all year round. First we're starting with Upsa Daisy's bath bomb. So it looks like this and then on the other side it has a different colour. So this one has a really strong floral fragrance. To me it has a very like rose scent um, but also almost kind of like a lily kind of fragrance from there. So this bath bomb is £3.50 and I'll read what he says on the website as normal. Have you ever smuggled your dirty laundry basket back into the house on a visit to mum? Or not being allowed over the doorstep without first taking off your mud drenched oops a daisy socks? If so, this cheerful grounding bath bomb is designed for you and your mum. It slowly dissipates beautiful essential oils, soothing rosewood, delicate rose and bright orange oil for a fragrance as gently sunny as a Sunday afternoon. The next bath bomb that I've got is called Mum Pink Bath. They have two colours of this, they have a pink one and they have a yellow one, so you can choose what colour you think your mum will like best. I have to say I absolutely love the smell of this. It smells like love hearts or sherbetty sweets or like swizzle lollies. One of my favourite smells I think Lush have ever done. So it looks like this. It says Mum with a little heart for the U. It's very cute. And it's kind of a multi-layered uh, bath bomb. This is 2 .95. It might seem strange that ah moment isn't included in the ingredients list of this calming blushing bath bomb. You'll certainly experience one when it touches the water. Sicilian lemon and sweet orange oils invite you to lay back with a smile. Rose softens the scent to create a light, fresh and floral experience that smells as satisfying as freshly laundered sheets. Close the door and take your time. So other bath bombs that I don't have are the yellow version of Mum. I also don't have the rose bombshell which um, has stayed on from Valentine's Day. So if you watch my Valentine's Day video you'll be able to hear all about rose bombshell. Now I'm going to move on to bubble bars. So we've got this one here, it's called Bar Bar. So my one has had a little bit of an accident and his head has come off. So he looks like this and it's a lovely little sheep bubble bar. This one has a really gorgeous violet fragrance, it's very like bathos if you like that. If you like curbside violet you'll like this as well. I love his little candy eyes and uh, I just love his, I just love that it's a sheep, I don't know why. This one is really cool as well because when you break it in half it's purple in the middle so it is like actual wool on the outside. This is 3 95 this adorable little critter wants to tuck you up under a blanket of comforting lavender, rose and lang lang to help you bed down for the night. Fluffy clouds of soy milk cuddle you close and bring softness while clove bud oil adds a toastiness and a warmth as you soak. A hint of bergamot teases out the grassier notes of fragrant lavender and violet promising sweet dreams and a fresh tomorrow. So now I have another one to show you. This is your Mother Should Know Bubble Bar and it's based off an ABBA lyric. And it looks like this. So you can see it's quite a big bubble bar and this is the same size as the comforter or bright side. It is $5.95 and it has the most amazing fragrance. It's the same fragrance as Frozen, Happy Happy Joy Joy, Elbow Grease, Sea Spray. I'm sure there's many others I've missed off there. Um, but it's just lovely. I love the flower on it. It really makes me think of something like really 60s or magic roundabout or something like that. Let's all draw a bath to feel grounded and warm. Bubble bars were a hit before your mother was born. Grounding rosewood in tangles with sharp grapefruit and heady neroli for a unique blend of zen. Your mother really should know about this one. Another bubble I don't have is the Ladybird bubble bar. This was part of the Valentine's range as well so you'll be able to see that on my other video. I'll link that video below actually because a lot of things have stayed on from Valentine's Day. So the new bubble bar I don't have is Elsie the giraffe and I'll put a little picture of it just here so you can see it. The reusable bubble bar is 6 95 but obviously you can get like eight baths out of it rather than two or three so it's worth the extra bit of money. 
Keep your head on the ground and lose sight of your head and sky. Heads or tails, choose one of your geranius giraffe to swish in the water and under the tap, then set her aside for another majestic bath time. Create the sumptuous... Whoa! Create a scrumptious, galumptious tower of bubbles as lemony yellow gallops across your bath. Lick swishy citrus will leave you feeling scrumdiddly umptious. Marvellous lemon and lime oils refresh your inner sparkle and grapefruit oils lift you to lofty new heights. Wash your neck, scrub your hooves, polish your legs and reach new bath time heights. So uh, this one has a gorgeous lemon fragrance. It's got lots of grapefruit and lemon in there. It does smell really nice actually, really citrusy. Unfortunately I just wasn't able to get one for this video. One more thing that I haven't got to show you that I want to talk about is the Oxford Street exclusive Mother Earth. So this was shown at the summit meeting that they had in February and it's basically a giant bath bomb and it looks like the world from above. So I'll read what it says. We are the world, we are the children, we are the ones who make a brighter day with uplifting zesty baths packed full of uplifting tangerine and invigorating peppermint oil. Let this luster filled wonder create a universe of utter serenity in the tub to refresh your sentence and make your world feel a little brighter. This one has a really gorgeous minty fragrance and it has a gorgeous pink inside as well. I'll pop a picture of it just here. The Mother Earth Bomb is £7.95. Now I'm going to move on to shower stuff. First up is Yummy Mummy Shower Cream. This is the same fragrance it was last year and the year before and it has a really nice fruity strawberry kind of fragrance. It's the same smell as the fluff shaving soap and it's also the same smell as strawberry feels forever massage bar so if you like those you're gonna love this one this size is 4.95 we also do 250 for 9.95 or 16.50 for 500 grams in the oxford street store only and i think online you can get the kilo size of this one for 27.95 so i'm going to read you the blurb it has sometimes a hug is all you need and this embrace of sweet Tonka Absolute and a conditioning fair trade organic cocoa butter is the perfect way to get your fix. Luxurious lathers of Brazilian orange and geranium oils will leave skin prettily perfumed with a nostalgic floral fragrance. Add a decadent drizzle to your morning routine for a paradisiacal pamper. Okay, so now we're moving on to a product I'm quite excited about. And it is this one here. And it's called Pink Custard. Put that over my face so you can see. It's called Pink Custard. Normally, I'm not like the biggest shower jelly fan, even though my bathroom would uh, suggest otherwise. But this one is amazing. And it is bright pink. And it has the same smell as one of my all-time favourite bath bombs. And that is Think Pink. It says, what do you get if you mix jelly and custard? No, not a strange dessert hybrid that's better left in a bowl, but a pudding sweet delight that sounds scrumptious as it sounds. This is no school dinner reject, it's for washing, not goblin. Swish and swipe, it's tantalising tonka and lavender jiggliness all over your wobbly bits and make showering as fun as it was way back then. This size here is £4.25, but we also do a bigger size for £8.50. We're moving on to the lips category now, because, you know, everyone's got them. And for Mother's Day... They bought out a brand new lip scrub and it is Honey Lip Scrub. So I'm very excited about this product because I've wanted a Honey Lip Scrub for quite a long time. And this one is perfect because it matches exactly with the Honey Trap Lip Balm. It's the same fragrance. This one here is 5.75. It says, stay honey mouth and sweet lipped wherever you go. Rub the sugary scrub over your lips and let spoonfuls of honey smooth your smackers. The menthol of peppermint oil cools and freshens while wild orange oil gives you a buzz. Get your honey for nothing. Get your lips for free. And last, possibly the most exciting product ever that has ever existed. So I'm going to get on with it and introduce Scrubby Body Butter. Basically, this is a really gorgeous Honey I Wash the Kids scented body scrub that is in the shape of a bee how amazing is that it has that gorgeous fragrance that honey sweet orange oil fragrance this the stripes here are um ground coconut uh, i'm too excited the scrubs are ground coconut husk and almond and it's just so freaking cute 
It says, meet Scrubby, the newest buffer on the block. With all that hydrating honey and cocoa butter, he may seem like a real softie, but don't underestimate his polishing power. He's packed full of ground coconut shells and ground almonds to give you a gentle, effective exfoliation. So yeah, that's him. I'm so excited. I'm going to have to buy about a million of them. Um, realistically, I'm probably gonna buy like, like eight of them actually, because who knows if it's gonna come back. Who knows? It could be gone forever after this Mother's Day and then we'll never have Scrubby again and then everyone will cry. If you want to buy Scrubby, he is £6.95. Please don't times that by eight and leave it in the comments. We've got four gorgeous designs for Not Wraps this year and they're all designed by an artist called, artist called Andy Lovell and they are really beautiful block print floral patterns we've got a hydrangea and a poppy which are a bigger size knot wrap and then smaller sizes we've got a lily and we've got a tulip so um go check them out in store as well they should all have them there for you to look at so thank you very much for watching if you like this then please subscribe to this channel and like this video every time someone likes this video it always means such a lot to me if you want to leave any questions about mother's day uh, at lush in the um, comment please feel free to and I'll try and answer them and yeah so thanks for watching bye